Well, hey guys, I uh, wanted to jump in here and uh, talk a little bit about the, uh, the voice recorder transcript that the NTSB has recently put out in regards to the dolly striking the key bridge up in Baltimore and uh, some things we, we noticed when we looked through uh, the report. Uh, it's, it's very detailed. Uh, the recorder, it's not only recording through different microphones within the spance of the bridge and on the wings of the bridge, but it's also recording uh, VHF channels. So they're getting the, the tug communications, the port communications, Coast Guard, uh, Channel 16. There's a few channels that they're recording, and uh, they, they were able to get that audio as well. Uh, but to me, uh, the most important part of this report starts at about page 15, when uh, at about 20 minutes after 2, the afternoon before any of this happened, before the ship left the port, the audio system picks up alarms that start going off, and they're detecting this automatic power switchover system uh, going off and with multiple alarms going off from uh, 220 uh, on up to uh, quite a while. Uh, it's, it's a couple hours there where uh, they're having multiple alarms, things are going off. And there's even a discussion uh, with the master of the ship about the engine room filling out a report, an in-depth report about this incident. Um, it seems to me that when the when the ship left, uh, there were some problems with the boat that were probably already known by uh, by the crew, and there is uh, a discussion that is picked up. Uh, through those microphones with the pilots. There were two pilots that were on the boat. There was a, uh, a pilot uh, scheduled to move the, sh the ship, and then also there was a pilot in training who kind of rides along, and he's getting experience uh, under the tutelage of, of, a, of, of a pilot doing his internship. He's on, on the ship as well, and uh, they're, they're both there, and you can hear them interacting as well. But when they come on, um, you know, they, they ask the master, hey, are, are we good to go? Is the ship in, in, you know, ready to go? And he says, yeah, yeah, it's good to go. Um, but as we all know, that certainly was not the case. Uh, we're going to put some, a link up here to the uh, transcript. I would encourage anybody that's interested in this, in this story and what happened. And guys, keep in mind... Six people lost their lives this night, just innocent guys who were up on the bridge. Um, read this transcript and, and read it in its entirety. Uh, take your time. And to me, when I read it, I could, I could feel the frustration, the aggravation. There was a time where, uh, you know, it's the, they called for the anchor to be uh, released. The pilots did. And... It was like two minutes before they got a response on that. So a lot going on here in this transcript. You guys take a look, look at it, and let me know what, what you guys think in the comments here. Uh, this, is, this is very interesting, very interesting reading. You guys take care. Please be safe out there.